take a little bit of sandpaper nice and easy. I know it looks pretty messy, but I think it's mostly just aluminum transfer. Yeah, the intake side looks good. All right. All right, so we're about 15 minutes into it. We're looking better. Okay, up toward the exhaust port there. I did use some, some 240, which is what my uh, flex hone, ball hone is. I don't want to do too much um, with that kind of course of a grit. I'd rather use some 320, but that spot right up there you can see. Let me get you focused in here. I'm going to try and hit that just a little bit more with the 240, not much more, and uh, we'll see uh, what we end up with. So against my better judgment, I'm going to use a little bit of 320 on the Arbor here. It's not like I got to get this thing done today, but <clears throat> just that heavy spot uh, right up near the exhaust that you saw. I'm just going to go just a little easy on that. Get some light in here. With some 320, oh, we came off here because I'm going too easy on it. You don't want to go too much. All right, we're working that one little area that you can see right down in there. So I'll put just a little more WD-40 in here, and it looks like we're doing all right. Hopefully. Let me put you right in here. If that works. That seems to be the heaviest right in this area right here. Have a look at it. No, oh, it's coming off there. It's not looking too bad. Hang on there. Slowly but surely. All right, I'll be back. So when you're working on this, it's kind of like doing body work. You don't want to sit in one spot. You want to change your angles a little bit. You can focus on the spot that's got the aluminum, but keep kind of moving it around. Because any of you guys who've done body work, you know, you keep sanding in one spot, what's going to happen? That one spot's going to be sanded and the, the rest of it's going to be, you know, it's not going to be smooth. So do the best you can. 
And then once the paper gets a little worn out, just rip a little bit off. Okay, then you'll have a fresh, fresh piece. We're starting to look pretty good on here. I still got to do uh, up above the exhaust port. All right, so we're looking pretty good there. Most of it's off. I'm going to do a little more. I got to do up above up above the exhaust port up here but I think it's gonna clean up pretty well so anyhow I'll be back when it's all set all right so after about an hour and 15 minutes we're looking pretty good all the transfer has gone off there um, the only thing that got a little close a little thin is right on the edge of this you know the bottom of the exhaust port but I'll just take and I'll put a little more bevel on there I'm not gonna hone this yet because I'm gonna do some port work to it up the top up in there, if you can see, there's a few little few little marks in there, but you're not going to get those out. Uh, overall, a success. Um, down in here, there's a little bit of the coating gone off here. Again, that won't happen if you do this by hand, but that's what happens with the power tools. But anyways, you won't get it done as quick. But overall, looks pretty nice. I get a hone in there, and uh, we'll be looking pretty good.